Alright guys, a few people asked me to do an OBS tutorial on uh, how to record with OBS, so here we go. So this is OBS, you can download it, just google OBS, and then when you come here you won't have any of this, this is all my stuff that I already set up, so I'm going to show you how this is up. So you'll have scenes and then sources, so you want to add a scene, so add a scene, and then you can call it whatever you want, so if you're streaming like League of Legends you just call it LOL, I already have one called LOL so it won't let me so I'm just gonna call it VV and then you create your scene and then you right click here and then you click add and then you can add a game capture a video capture device uh, the, CLR, the CLR browser is for donation alerts you can add text, slideshows, images window capture and monitor capture so if you, I wouldn't recommend using monitor capture for anything so like for when you're playing League of Legends uh, when you're not in game, you want to use window capture, but when you're in the actual game, like a DirectX 9 game, you want to use uh, game capture. So you just click game capture, and then just call it whatever you want. You can call it like League of Legends. Now it'll find everything that's open, right? So you want to, you would have to open your League of Legends and then uh, click on it, and it would find it. So then you you select League of Legends here, and then click OK and there and then as soon as you open League of Legends and you're playing it it'll show up on your stream and of course you can add like text above it and all that and you can move your layers up and down on here now another question that I get asked is how do you stream so when you go in here this will all be all this stuff will be like um, basic so if you have a potato internet like I do you probably want to keep your bitrate around 1500 or 2k so and if you see that you're dropping frames, maybe um, maybe turn your bitrate down. So we can preview a stream right here. As you can see, it's not showing anything because I don't actually have the game open, and my uh, mouse is uh, flickering because that's part of like Windows. Uh, it's like a glitch. So if you see like drop frames, 0.0%, 0 .0%, that means I'm not dropping any frames at 2,000 kbps. So if you want to, if so, if you are dropping frames, just go into your settings and turn your kbps down right here and also you got quality balance and you can use different encoders if you if you're you can use quick sync on intel or in your nvidia encoder i would recommend doing that if you have the ability to so other than that you can get your stream keys uh from which is this which you don't want to share with anyone don't ever share your stream key with anyone um you can get that in the appropriate places like for Twitch which is the most popular streaming site is twitch.tv slash broadcast that's where you'll find your stream key if you're logged into your account and uh, if you're Twitch streaming you want to make just click Twitch and then click the closest server to you in the world Google it if you don't know which is the closest place and then enter your stream key via that and if you're streaming on YouTube you have to go custom and there'll be two links uh, like the the live server link and then your stream key so you just copy and paste both those and you can find those on YouTube and uh, Google it if you don't know how. I'm not going to show it in this video because it would be showing my uh, key on street, on video. So other than that, you can change your audio, you can apply hotkeys, stuff like that. This is all basic stuff. You can change your settings, how many, like, how buffering, what priority your live stream is, and all that stuff. I'd recommend leaving most of this alone if you don't know what you're doing. And you can change your quality and what you're recording with and your aspect ratio and all that. So I would leave most of it alone until you feel like uh, fiddling around with it because it could mess up your stream. But but just messing with the basic stuff like your bitrate and your um, audio is how you want to do it. So anyway guys, hopefully this video helped. If it did, leave a like. Uh, comment down below if you have any questions. I'll be sure to answer all of them. And I'll see you in my next video guys. Bye.